welcome. So today we are discussing uh, Lewin's change theory or Lewin's change model. But before we go there, let's discuss what change. Let's define change. So we are saying change. This is the act or process through which some something becomes different. Okay. So good. Lewin's change model. Now. There are three steps in Lewin's change model, namely unfreezing, changing, and refreezing. So an ice block is used as an example to understand this model. Okay, so this is a, an ice block talking about water which has been frozen. Okay. So this water which has been frozen, for it to change into another shape, it will be very difficult to change it. So what are we going to do? We need to unfreeze it. When you unfreeze the water, that's when now you can implement the change. When now the shape has, when it has been implemented the change, you freeze it again. You will refreeze it. Okay. So this is a, a model. This is an example that is used. In a Lewin's change model. Okay, so now in unfreezing, in unfreezing, this is the stage where communication is done on the change that will take place. Okay, this is so because some people naturally resist change. Okay, so the aim during the unfreezing stage is to create awareness on the current level of acceptability which is uh, hindering the organization in some way. So you need to explain that the current system or the current things that we are doing, they are hindering the organization in some way. Therefore, we need to change so that we improve. So communication is the way. Okay. When the communication has been done, we come to step number two, which is changing. This is where the organization moves from the old state to the new state. Okay. This is, there is an implementation of change. Okay. So in unfreezing, you communicated, you talked about the advantages of a uh, the new change that will come, we talk about the disadvantages of the old way of doing things. Okay, now the time to implement the change. When it has been implemented now, you come, you need to freeze again. Okay, so now this freezing, we call it refreezing. This is called refreezing to symbolize the act of reinforcing, stabilizing, and solidifying the new state after the change. So this will prevent people from going back to their old ways of thinking. So when the, the new things now, they have been implemented, they have to be followed. Okay, so you need to solidify so that people, they don't go back to their Old ways. Okay, so this was a short topic about Lewin's change model. Okay, remember, there's something that you need to take note of that this channel is not a substitute of school and the hospital. All right, there's more information. You can add more. Until next time, bye bye.